Welcome to Creative Nerds. In today's Photoshop tutorial, we'll be sharing with you how you can create a cylinder text effect using Photoshop. So firstly, we want to start off by duplicating our original layer of our model. And then we're going to select the Select Subject option, or you can use the Magic Wand tool. So we're simply just going to isolate the model so she's no longer on the pink background. And then we're going to head over to a layer mask then that isolates the model so she's no longer on the pink background. And then for the next thing we want to do is we want to head over to our adjustment layer options and we want to select black and white and then that will create a black and white mask. We want to, want to keep that as the, first, as the top layer. We're then going to write out some text. So we're going to go with creative. I'm um, just going to center that in the middle of our canvas. We're then going to press Command T or Control T if on a Windows PC. Right click, select Warp, and then we're going to go over to the Warp drop down options and select Cylinder. And then we're going to select Done. Duplicate that layer once more. And then we want to bring that layer underneath our masks layer and then we're going to drag that text up our layer that we just created and then we're going to press command command t right click warp and we're simply just going to drag up the anchor point so it mirrors the effect but going upwards this time and then press enter and then we're just going to drag it behind our text so it creates that that cylinder text effect and then from there we're going to select both of our text layers and we're just going to make this effect bigger so it fills up more of the image so that that looks great now what we, now what we're going to do from there is we're going to duplicate it once more each text layer and we're just going to move it up and this time we're going to go to blending options and we're just going to change the text to be white so that's okay okay again and then we're going to do the same for the text layer that's behind the masks layer duplicate layer select okay okay and then select blending options again change the color overlay to be white and then we're going to move move that layer up that we just duplicated and change the blending options on so it's going to simply just move that layer up And there you go, we created a really cool cylinder text effect, which takes less than a few minutes to achieve the end result. And there's so much more that you can add to this to further enhance the design. Thanks for watching and stay tuned to Creative Nerds for further quick tips on how to use Photoshop.